when we designed the uh, security program, we built it so that the message would be reinforced. Um, so when, when new staff is onboarded, we have a security induction uh, training. In that training, we share actual examples of attacks that we have seen that were targeting um, certain members of staff. Um, if we have people of a certain job role and we've seen attacks tailored to that job role, we will uh, highlight that as well. So we try to tailor it a bit to the audience. We reinforce this um, security awareness campaign with posters and um, I would say quarterly messaging by myself on, on new threats and, and how to deal with them. Uh, specifically tailored to, to BAC, we have a wider anti-phishing uh, program where we explain the psychology of the of the attacker and how they will try to induce a response from from staff and the security measures that we have in place um, like visually marking uh, emails tagging them as spam um, filtering them to a separate folder um, so we, we educate people on on what kind of controls we offer to the organization and what they can expect. But then most importantly, we tell them, look, if you get a request that in any way seems abnormal, especially if a sense of urgency uh, is being created, it is all right for you to question that, to reach out to the alleged counterparty via um, internal means and ask a confirmation. Did that message come from you? Um, so we, we establish that culture. Later on, we will then start uh, an internal phishing campaign. And after a while, we also perform um, a more targeted uh, red team exercise. Um, in the phishing campaign, for instance, the, the goal is not to trick employees 100% um, into clicking on a link or in, in um, sharing information. And, and that's what I see goes wrong in a lot of these campaigns. The planning phase and, and how you reach the objective are, are key. Um, I saw that even with my teams, they were at some point really trying to figure out for this user population, what is the most effective message that's going to yield the highest click rate. And, and I had to adjust that to say, well, that's not the scope of the exercise. Um, we're also not going to relax our security controls to make our campaign more, uh, more effective because we've been training people on the effectiveness of certain controls and we want them to feel that um, this is a piece of education that we're offering and, and that we're not um, out there to get them, if that makes sense.